Hello everyone and welcome back. I hope that everybody is doing well. In this video, I wanted to talk to you about an outerwear piece that I actually purchased back in July. So back in July of this year, I purchased my Burberry trench coat and I did that because I was super, super excited to begin wearing it for this fall. And actually, fall here in the States does officially start tomorrow. So tomorrow, September 22nd, is the first official day of fall. And I'm really excited because fall is actually my favorite season. And it is because I just like to be cozy. I love the weather. I love the leaves turning colors. And all that is just my favorite. So I'm super excited. And I wanted to share this uh, coat with you because I feel like it's a very, very essential piece for anybody's wardrobe. It is something that is going to be in your wardrobe if you take care of it for very many, many years to come. And it is super um, versatile. You can wear it with many, many things. And actually in this video, I'm going to show you how I would wear it. I'm not going to be changing my clothes and that is why I picked something super neutral, which this sweater and a pair of black leggings. The only thing I'm going to be changing are my shoes and I will be changing from boots, from high heels, flats, um, loafers, sneakers and all that stuff just so that you guys can see that this coat actually goes with several several things and everything looks good with it. So I wanted to show you the coat that I got and I actually purchased this from the Burberry Boutique and when I got it that day, they actually, look at this, it is huge, they actually gave me this box, this bag and this box because they were out of garment bags that day and I was a little bit disappointed because I didn't want it in the box. I told the uh, sales associate there that it was going to get wrinkled and that I wanted to hang it up as soon as I got home. But she told me that they didn't have any. But anyway, uh, she put my receipt in this little envelope here and this Burberry box that she wrapped my coat in is super big as well. So a few days later in the mail, I actually got a package from that same sales associate and it was my garment bag. So she wrote in there and told me that uh, she apologized for not having the garment bags, but that she knew I really wanted one. So she sent me one through the mail. So here it is. My coat in the garment bag that she sent me and I have stored it here since. Like I said, since July, and it has a zipper in the back here. And it's just super convenient for traveling too, so that's why I wanted it. Like, I, I really was bummed out that she didn't get me one, but so happy now that she sent me one. And this is the coat that I purchased. So this particular coat is from the Heritage Collection and it is called the Chelsea. And the Chelsea is actually their slimmest fit in coats and that's what I wanted. I wanted, um, well now I want a lot of several things but um, at the time when I purchased this I wanted a slim fit coat that would be very stylish and of course keep me warm and this is the one that she pulls out and the size that I got it in was a US 4, UK 6, and Italian 38. So she asked me what size was I in dresses. And I said, well, I'm a 2 or a 4. So she said, okay, well, let's start with the 4. And um, she pulled out the 4, and, she, and it was this color. And guys, when I tell you, I'm not kidding. It was love at first sight. I absolutely loved it. It it fit like it was made for me. So while in the boutique, I told her that I wasn't sure of the color because as you may know, black is my favorite color. So I wanted to try the coat in black. So before she did that, I tried several other fits. I tried the Kensington, I believe. And I tried some, I can't remember the other name of it, but they just weren't what I was looking for. They fit nicely, but they just weren't the fit that I wanted. Some of them were longer and some of them were a little bit more boxier, a little bit more relaxed fit, which is actually what I'm looking for now. Um, I'm not like, 
actively trying to purchase this but um, in the future if I do purchase another Burberry coat it will be probably a, a longer fit and a more relaxed fit and maybe in black and anyway so I tried those other different fits and then I said well can I try the same Chelsea in the black so that's what she did she went and got it for me and when I tried it on it just wasn't the same I felt like this color just popped a little bit more on me I don't know how because I love black but I went ahead and went with this one um, this one is pretty simple um, it doesn't have the checkered detail on the back of the collar which I kind of wanted but then I was to thinking um, when the heck am I gonna pop my collar like I never do that so I was just like you know what forget about the collar detail that I told you I wanted forget it um, this is actually the one that fit me better so this is the one that I was happy to purchase and this is what the back looks like and I will be doing um, long shots of this like I said showing you different um, shoes with it same outfit but just different shoes but it's a super pretty and simple coat and that's what the inside looks like I still have the tags because of course I haven't worn this but let me tell you how much it is if you are interested okay so US dollars is 1990 minus your taxes so with <laughs> let's see with uh, taxes here where I live I ended up paying um, 2134 dollars so I think it's um, you know it's a pretty steep price for a coat in general but it's a very well made coat that's gonna like I said last me very very many many years and it just goes well with everything so I just decided to get it because it was on my wish list for a long time and I'm super excited that I finally have it and that I get to wear it soon um, so yeah guys that's pretty much it I'm gonna go ahead and go outside and film myself wearing the coat with different shoe options so that you can see all the options that you can have
that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed everything. I hope that that gave you some insight on if you want to buy this coat or not. Um, I do say that you should buy it. You should invest in it. It's a super, super pretty pretty piece and it's so well made and it goes with everything like I said. So if you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I will be leaving you two more videos here on the side of the screen. If you are not done watching me, you can continue watching there. Please, please, let's never forget to be kind to one another. I've always said that since the beginning because it is super, super important. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.